Today is the day that I decided to pull this camera out from my basement. So I bought this camera, the G7X, a long time ago with my friend Annie. We used to take Instagram pictures using our big like Canon cameras, like for Instagram, just because we were into photography and that kind of stuff. And she bought this camera because it's easier to fit in our purse. And I was like, I need to have that. Anyways, I have started many YouTube channels before and they've all been deleted since because I don't know they were embarrassing. I think I have everything dialed in now. So today is the day that I pulled my camera out and just have fun with it. I think YouTube is a really cool place to have everything documented. So, and of course I'm starting this off looking like this, but you know, that's just reality and whatevs. I'm gonna stop talking. <laughs> are heading over to Target and Sephora. From Sephora, I just wanna browse like body wash or something because I currently don't have any body wash. I've just been using whatever I can find. Also, I'm using this like jelly stuff to get rid of any sort of dust in my car. It's kind of fun. <laughs> Maintenance just walked by. He totally saw my camera, whatever, I don't care. I am so scatterbrained. I'm just trying to clean this. Has anyone tried this stuff? I saw it on TikTok. guys it is the next day i never ended up doing a sephora haul but i will do that today my mom just asked if i wanted to go get coffee with her at our local coffee shop and that's what i'm gonna do i need to refresh myself and kind of pull myself together but i feel like i'm having kind of a good hair day sometimes when i wake up like i never know what to expect i used this dry shampoo this morning and holy cow i think it's my favorite one now i love it and it smells really really yummy I believe this is like Khloe Kardashian's hair stylist's hair line. God, that was a tongue twister. But anyways, I love that. They sent it to me and I was very pleasantly surprised. It's funny because I always wake up before the sun and Adam was sleeping this morning. So I had to be extra quiet in all those clips. Let's freshen up. <laughs> Here's a little timestamp. We're meeting at 1030, so I kind of have to hustle, but that's plenty of time. I'm just going to refresh some of my curls using my Dyson. I'm also going to bring you guys along everything when I film a TikTok because I think it's kind of interesting, especially being in Michigan. Like we are working with like gray sky 24 seven. I put you guys on Chloe's dog kennel. She sleeps every night. We call this my office, but it's actually Chloe's bedroom. I'm using the same brand that I use their dry shampoo, but for their texture spray. I have to say, I am so glad I got this Dyson. 
You guys, it's really, it's really changed my life. I have never tried this tinted moisturizer until they sent it to me. Safe to say it is one of my favorite makeup products like on the market. I only fill in the tails of my eyebrows and I absolutely hate the shape of which eyebrow? Of my right eyebrow. I don't know, something about it is like super not flattering to my face, but like I don't know what to do about that. I think my left eyebrow is a little bit more arched and maybe that's why I like it. I don't know. Brow gel. I'm just gonna curl my lashes. Okay. Mm, maybe I'll add a little bit of eyeliner. And then if your wing is ever messed up, just take a dry beauty blender. Go like that. I think that's all I'm going to do for makeup. Oh, I need some chapstick, though. Mm-hmm. Okay. What time is it? It's 10 o'clock exactly, like... I can get ready really fast now. Boom. Cut. I'm just going to wear a little set active set. I threw in some silver hoops because I love silver hoops. They just make everything better. I need to change out of my pajama bottoms, but yeah, I'm just going to throw on some leggings, some sneakers, a jacket, and grab my purse and head out the door. Chloe just got a bath nice. and she smells so good. We used the waist shampoo for her. It smells so good. She smells like luxury, huh? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Cases are from the brand Kish and my headboard is from I got it years ago but it's from a sister brand of Wayfair I believe and it's called Birch Lane and it's a great bed I love it hey club today is Sunday and I love Sundays I am just now getting around to Oh, <laughs> and I'm just now getting around to showing you guys what I got from Sephora. Got all the goodies in here. And I actually got good stuff this time. Like I'm, I really like what I got. The first thing is this Sephora facial roller. It's supposed to help sculpt your face. Lord knows I need that. Oh, it feels so good. I put it in the freezer this morning. Under eyes. Next is the Summer Fridays Jet Lag Mask. I used this last night and now I really realize the hype. I understand why everyone's obsessed with it. Especially in Michigan, my skin is so dried out from how cold it is. I got the Brazilian Boom Boom Cream and yes, it is Boom Boom Cream. I initially went to get the body wash but they didn't have it in stock. But I still wanted to get something from the line, so I just got their cream. I've gotten it before, and yes, it smells just as good as everyone says. I got the Inky List Retinol Serum, and I've been using retinol, especially from Inky List, for 
a very very long time it is one of the only products that i feel like actually makes a difference with my skin some people react really bad with retinol but this stuff love um last from sephora is the dr jart firming collagen rubber mask i was between this one and the brightening one but i chose <laughs> i chose the collagen one because the mask is pink which just explains me to a t anything pink i love it i probably will do this tonight or i'll save it for a self-care day i'm really pumped for that and i also went to target because i like i said i needed body wash and they didn't have the one that i wanted at sephora so i just got the native body wash in coconut and vanilla it is sulfate free paraben free dye free oh yeah it smells really yummy you want to smell oh yeah that smells really really good huh yeah that smells really good that is my little haul um i'm trying to think so adam's parents are coming into town tonight and we're all gonna go out to dinner i want to film some tiktoks today because it's not disgustingly gray out it's it's white out <laughs> but it's not gray which is which is good um so i need to film some tiktoks i can show you guys a little behind the scenes because i think it's kind of interesting um and i need to go to the gym i have a lot of like new year's resolutions and last year it was to get my butt in the gym and to really grind and i did that like i lost since college i've lost like 25 pounds which is insane because i'm five foot two and losing 25 pounds as someone who is five foot two is a lot of weight like that is a lot of weight and i'm really proud of it kind of do the same thing that i did last time which allowed me to get into this really healthy cycle but i think i want to prioritize other things this season um and that's okay life is all about making priorities and obviously i'm still gonna go to the gym but i went really hard last time hi is there anything else chloe is there anything else we need to talk about do you tell them that you were a really good girl yesterday you were angel also this is my absolute favorite favorite robe of all time i don't know how i scored it but because now it's like sold out everywhere. I can't even find it online. But it is from Skims. And it's the hot pink bubblegum pink robe. And I get a lot of questions on TikTok about this robe. And yes, it is my absolute favorite robe. Oh, Chloe's toy. Okay. And then grab my phone okay it is 10 58 and this is just a little time stamp but i'm getting ready to film one or two tiktoks i can't pre-film a whole lot because i don't know my stamina gets low and i also like when they're just filmed on different days when my hair looks different and just little things like that but this is my usual setup so i put my tripod right in front of this window usually chloe is right here Kitty is usually right up there and yeah this is my setup i also have this little light but i don't use it very often because i find that it dies very quick so if it is absolutely disgusting out and i need to film something i will turn that on but usually i just you know let the natural light do its thing i also need to <laughs> get rid of this baby gate because we have that up for the cat we keep all the cat stuff in that bathroom and we have the baby gate because we have a puppy and i don't want her eating cat turds and cat food so i need to get rid of that and shut the door because i like a really clean background in regards to makeup i usually just do something super light today i did extra light because you know my hair's not looking that great i'm not really feeling myself today and i just want to get one or two done and carry on also i just choose like any sort of outfit i like keeping it neutral especially because my page ultimately is my resume um and 
even though I have a lot of pink, I also have a lot of neutrals. Like my content is very neutral besides the pink. I think this is a good way to promote myself when, you know, brands stumble across my page. It's beneficial. So it's kind of my thought process and let me close all this stuff up. Okay, first one, we shut this door because I like the white wall better. Next, we get rid of the baby gate. Put it in here and I say, sorry kitty, you're gonna have to go a little bit without food, water, and <laughs> um, the potty. Cute, okay. So this is the setup. I will typically film in CapCut, so I'll open CapCut. But sometimes I do just film in the TikTok app. I find it much easier and it just kind of depends on the style of content. Also, I have all my video ideas in my notes section and when I complete them, I just mark them as done. So I'm just gonna go through and see what I could do for today. And I just posted a TikTok. I'm experimenting with different times now. I usually post around three, but I am experimenting with different times just to see, I don't know. Um, okay. So for today, I'm going to be filming my, how I prep my hair for bed to keep it healthy because I do have a routine for that. So I need to go get some scrunchies, a brush, hair oil, and my silk pillowcases. Back. And I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna start TikToking. And just like that, hair is up in a pony. So this portion of the social media side is I am going to edit some TikToks kind of look at what's trending in the hair beauty community um, and also edit some of this vlog. And I am going to be uploading on YouTube every Tuesday. I think Tuesday is a good day. Also, this needs some serious help. Um, I need to do laundry but I need to better organize this closet. Like my clothes are pretty fine. But all down here, I have technology stuff in there, laundry, um, extra PR and hair stuff, and then like jeans and big sweatpants that don't fit in my dresser. I have a lot that needs some work. Okay, I am wrapping this up for today, but I wanted to show you the products that I used in the shower. I did the full routine. Hair wash, body, shave, you know, the whole thing. These are the products that I used today. The medium shampoo and conditioner by Way are my absolute favorites. And then my new body wash from Native. And I use Flamingo for shaving. I really like their shave gel and their razors. And then I am going to be using this. Make sure I am nice and moisturized. That is it for this little vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. <laughs>